Hi guys, it's me and I am um here <laughs> reborning. Um this is my personal kit, my Grayson kit. Um I actually have some updates I wanted to um let you guys in on. So um I'm working on, like I said, uh, another one of my personal babies, which is the Grayson kit by Bonnie Brown. And if you hear the um noise in the background, it's actually my oven. Um I have her her limbs and I already told you what what it was. It's a girl. Um, I already have her limbs in the um, oven. So yeah, we're just waiting on her arms and legs to get out so we can do some more painting. Um, right now I'm working on um, a little blushing. I gave her a layer of flesh, but other than that, it's, um, she's really not nowhere near done. I mean. She's really just started, probably like one percent. I can actually say. Um, you can see some of her modeling on her belly plate, though. Kinda. Well, I mean, of course I can see it. Um, but anyway, some updates. Um, my custom spot has been filled. It has actually been filled for a week. Um, but I have a custom Sydney kit that I am doing, um, and the lady wanted um a skin tone similar to Waverly's so I'll be starting that baby as soon as her tummy plate comes in um and like like I said while I wait I just started on my Grayson um my aunt's doll it's taken me a long time to get her done and um, because of my customs um she is she's not really a custom she's kind of like a gift for my aunt but every time I start her I start another doll so She's getting done. Um, hopefully she'll be done soon. You can't really see any of her details. But I think she is the lamb kit. Um, I'm I'm not really sure. I think she is though. Um, I haven't worked on her in a while like I said. But um, I'm getting her face done tonight. And then I'll start back up on her limbs. Which her limbs have a lot to go. So um, that's what's in the works next. Um, I actually have a baby done and she will be up for sale this weekend yay um my first well it's not my first time painting hair but it's um my second i would say my second time successfully painting hair i have done it another time before um if you guys remember um limerick um she had painted hair but i rooted over it um a blonde hair over her hair and then i did Ellie and or Eloise and Eloise um had hair rooted over her painted hair too um but this baby um will be so excited to introduce you guys to which I will do a separate video on her right now her glossing is drying and um yeah I think I'm gonna go ahead and put her magnets in as well so um there should be a video up about her um fairly soon but, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys updates. Oh, yeah, um, I also got a tripod, finally. Um, so, I will be able to use my other camera. And I can actually do better videos and um, some, I guess, some changing videos and some feeding videos and some, um, like, the details videos where the camera's not too shaky. Because, honestly, my phone is heavy. So, trying to hold it with one hand and juggle, and juggle um, trying to... Maneuver a baby is it's kind of hard because my babies are heavy. I like my babies weighted on the heavier side, so they're pretty floppy and heavy. So, um, look out for those videos. Um, what else? Um, nothing much. My desk is a mess. Um, like I said, I'm painting. Um, but, um, other than that, I am just excited to start on my next custom i've never done a sydney kit but i thought it was the cutest little kit um it has the, a really really cute mouth so i'm excited to work on that but um yeah guys that's all i have to say and thank you guys for watching bye